everything you need to know about building self-confidence. Self-confidence is the most important skill to have in life. It's the foundation of everything from career success to relationships. It's not easy to build self-confidence, but it's possible with a little work and determination. Self-confidence is the belief in one's own ability to succeed. It is not a complicated concept. We all need self-confidence to be able to do anything worth doing. The key to building self-confidence is realizing that it is a skill and not an innate trait. It can be learned and practiced, just like any other skill. When we're not sure how we feel about a situation, things might be complicated. There are many reasons why we sometimes feel less confident than others, from the environment to how we're feeling that day. This video will explore some of the things that may be going on in our heads. Number 1. The importance of self-confidence, and why you should start your journey now. Self-confidence is a virtue that seems to be in short supply these days. It's not uncommon to hear people say they lack self-confidence, or that they don't have enough of it. The good news is, there are some simple things you can do to boost your self-confidence and start feeling better about yourself. Maintaining a healthy sense of self-confidence is an important part of mental health. When people lack self-confidence, they start feeling negative thoughts and feelings about themselves that can spiral out of control. Self-confidence is the key to success. It is the foundation for all other qualities that lead to success. Without it, you will never be able to build the necessary momentum needed in order to succeed. Number 2. Why self-confidence is important for your success. Self-confidence is important for your success because it drives you to do more and believe in yourself. Without self-confidence, you will never be able to achieve anything in life. It is the fuel that keeps you going and helps you stay strong when things get tough. Being confident is an important part of the equation for success in any field. A person with a strong sense of self can take risks, see opportunities where others see failure, and pursue personal goals without feeling shame or guilt for not meeting society's demands. Number 3. Why you shouldn't worry about your mental health and just get on with life. Many of us are guilty of worrying about our mental health. We worry about whether we have depression, anxiety, or other mental illnesses. But we should not worry too much about our mental health and just get on with life. The World Health Organization defines mental health as a state of well-being in which every individual realizes his or her own potential, can cope with the normal stresses of life, can work productively and fruitfully, and is able to make a contribution to her or his community. Mental illness is an illness that disrupts the way a person thinks, feels, behaves or relates to others. It is important to remember that there are many people who suffer from various mental illnesses but still live fulfilling lives. For example, Winston Churchill had bipolar disorder but he was still one of the greatest leaders of all time. Number 4. The problem with perfectionism, how perfectionism can destroy your self-confidence. And why you need to let go now. Perfectionism is a state of mind where you are always striving to be perfect. In the process, you often find yourself feeling like a failure because of the high standards that you set for yourself. It is important to understand that perfectionism can be both good and bad. It can help us achieve success in our careers and it can also lead to personal unhappiness. The problem with perfectionism is that it does not allow for mistakes, which in turn leads to self-doubt and low self-confidence. The first step to overcoming perfectionism is to identify what causes it. The main reasons for its manifestation could be your own thoughts about your work and whether or not they are realistic. The next step is to make changes in those thoughts. Mindset is the main reason behind your productivity. Your mindset is the one thing that dictates your productivity more than anything else. A positive attitude and the right mindset can help you get more done in less time. While a negative attitude can hold you back, even when you have everything going for you. I hope you enjoyed the video. Please share the video and subscribe to our channel for more intuitive content.